Hello, it's Richard at Richard's Guitars, and um, uh, yeah, today I've got a, uh, a Dovina Paduk to show you. And um, yeah, the Paduk is one that I'm, I've not referred to uh, in the videos um, to this point. And I am guilty of holding back. Um, obviously, if I haven't got the guitar to hand, I can't show it you. And, um, but behind the scenes, the Paduk has been this kind of, um, um, the dark horse, that's the one, the dark horse. So the Paduk is the dark horse of the Dovina range. Um, and what I mean by that is that it's highly understated. So let me just show you something. So this is the Paduk. Uh, it's what I would call, it has a beautiful burnt sort of rougey, autumnal colour to it. So that's that's what it has, it has like a, a, a hue, autumnal hue is what maybe the way I look at it. Um, see these beautiful bindings, everything that's done on these master series are absolutely exquisitely put together. So it's kind of um, understated, uh, very very beautifully put together. It's got the old beautiful abalone and that's a, a dolomite spruce top on this one. So it doesn't shout at you, it doesn't sort of, um, it's not flame maple, it's not like sort of a, a dramatic rosewood or ebony, a striped ebony. There's all these things you can get quite excited about. Even the walnut finishes can be quite dramatic. So Paduk is more restrained in its visual, but the Paduk is the, the tone wood for power, strength and balance is the way I describe it. It's an incredible tone wood. And it wasn't until uh, Stan, from uh, who owns Dovina Guitars, um, it was his personal recommendation. He was actually talking about a nylon string guitar at the time. And, um, and it makes complete sense why, um, that he was saying that if you want the best tone, go for Paduk, it's my number one, just, just try a Paduk guitar, and, um, which obviously I did, and then I never looked back. And when we've had Paduk guitars in the shop, the average time a Paduk will stay in our shop is about seven days, literally seven days. Uh, I've just had two delivered, and uh, hence why I wanted to show you this one. And, um, but the moment somebody tries one, it just walks out the shop. So I'll just, I'll just quickly show you why. Um, obviously, I can't do justice to the, the playing, but I, I will just, just hearing a chord makes a difference, doesn't it? Just being able to hear anything. So this is a, uh, play a G chord here. The Paduk also has this beautiful um, leaf inlay as the masters tend to. Uh, so see if you can just get it. Oh, there you go, in the light there. Isn't that beautiful? And that's all Paduk. Um, wood, a wood inlay, all made from Paduk. Uh, it's got the Paduk, um, uh, binding down down the uh, the neck of the guitar as well. Really beautiful. Isn't that gorgeous? Gold hardware. Yeah. Okay. And there's the uh, abalone inlay. It's um, okay, so tonally, as I was saying, it's a um, very strong sounding guitar. So it has this beautiful sustain, um, power. It's still resonating now. If you can hear that. So, you hear that throughness that I always hear that when you hear a great guitar, just boom. That chime, clarity. All the notes ringing true. No, it's not stodgy sounding. It's not overly bright sounding. Um, it's it's just a beautiful blend between mahogany and rosewood. Oh, excuse the noise. Um, isn't that lovely?
beautiful. There you go, so that gives you, gives you an idea. What do you think? What do you think of that? So really strong, powerful, clean, bright. But but it's not too clinical. It's it's smooth, but not 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 kind of um, it, it it's not too smooth, not too too sort of soft around the edges. Uh, really nice definition. One of the strongest sounding acoustic guitars in the range in terms of. Um, and not just in the range of Dovina, but one of the strongest acoustic sounds I think you can buy. Yeah, lovely, absolutely beautiful. That's the Paduke. Paduke. Absolutely, look at it, every detail, just gorgeous. Every detail, absolutely magnificent. And this being, oh, I haven't mentioned also the, uh, yeah, again, I, this doesn't mean an awful lot to me, but this was tuned to, uh, the top was C sharp. Um, and uh, there's another bit of numbering on there. And then we've got the name of the chappy that, um, built this but it's lovely you know you've got the name of the person that actually put the guitar together you can track it back to the individual that um, put the top and that did the tuning of the guitar incredible um, yeah so thanks to Domina as for um, another wonderful guitar tell me what you think of it that's the Paduke check out um, guitars like the first range you'll find Paduke is used um, only on the very, very top of the range guitars. Uh, Paduke is very much a premium tone wood used only on the uh, most expensive instruments. And uh, But I think Dovna have really done justice to the beauty and the natural understated uh, feel of this guitar. It really is uh, uh, what I'd call a connoisseur's guitar. Someone who's not trying to be overly flash, they just know they want a great sounding guitar that looks beautiful in its simplicity almost. Um, okay, thank you very much, speak to you soon, bye.